a pretty thin runoff area down there and he's had a catastrophic failure of the left rear suspension and gone straight on at turn one with an errant left rear wheel bouncing down the racetrack. This has just happened and off he goes straight into the tyre barrier. Luckily he hits head on which is where the nose does its best work and the front suspension taking some of the energy too. is closer now than he's ever been at this point. This is the Ferrari's opportunity, having failed to score a world championship point, and Mansell goes through. Oh, fantastic! Nigel Mansell, as he and Senna come up to pass the Onyx, takes the lead. Now, is he going to pull away? Tremendous opportunism driving, because he didn't have long to think about that. He had to get round Senna as well. I think for me, it was a fantastic race. The first time in my career, I'll say it was an unbelievable race. Uh, very extraordinary, and uh, Ayrton had a little bit of bad luck with traffic, but uh, you know, it was super. Oh, there's a big crash there. Big crash here, very big crash indeed. Garcia is involved in it, one of the Toro Rossos, I think. One of the McLarens is involved as well. Is it Raikkonen? It is Raikkonen. Kimi Raikkonen is out of this Grand Prix. He's leading this train. He just runs smash straight into the back of the uh, Toro Rosso of, I think it's Tonio Liuzzi. And bodywork everywhere. Just huge speed differential. Della Rosa picks his way through the gap. Waller, look at the parts of bodywork everywhere. Almost rolls the car over the top of Liuzzi. And what a dramatic incident. Safety car has been deployed here. Hamilton's off the road. Yeah, he's been off, and I'm not really sure. That front tyre looks like it's punctured. It is. He's got a left front puncture. Lewis Hamilton and the McLaren mechanics are going to have to uh, scramble here. He's going to have to make an unscheduled stop, I think. And this could be a huge turning point in the championship. He's going to lose an acre of time here. Before qualifying even began, there was controversy. Fernando Alonso felt Robert Dornbos hindered a flying lap during Friday's second practice. Alonso was deemed to have deliberately brake tested the Red Bull and was handed a one-second time penalty for each part of qualifying. This was in addition to another one-second penalty he received for overtaking under waved yellow flags later in the session. Jensen Button's fiery car brought out the red flag in Saturday practice, but it was the other championship contender that made a big mistake. Kubica followed Alonso and both slowed in response to the flag. But Michael passes them both and he too gets a two-second time penalty for each part of qualifying.